I am Anil Kumar and now we are learning to understand how to find integrals for trigonometric functions. Now if we have sine and cosine products as we have in this case, we need to analyze their powers. Which ones are evens, which ones are odd. The relation between sine and cosine is sine square x plus cos square x is equal to 1. That's the relation between them. And both are square, so that means uh, we have to see what one, which is odd one. So odd one out is cos x. So our first step will be here to write this as squares, sine square x cos to the power of 4x, that is the even powers, and keep the odd aside. So we have cos x dx. Do you understand? So we have cos x dx, which we want to convert to du. So that means we could make a substitution of u equals to sin x, correct? So if I write u is sin x, then du will be equals to cos x dx, correct? So that will take care of this part. So let's now continue. So now we can write this as, since we have substituted u as sin x, we don't want cosine here, right? So we write this as sine square x instead of cos we can write this as cos square x equals to 1 minus sine square x correct so we'll replace this with 1 minus sine square x whole square right since it is 4 times cos x dx now we can substitute u for sine so we get u square and we have 1 minus u squared to the power of 2 times du, correct? And now that's a polynomial. We can open this bracket. So 1 minus 2u squared plus u to the power of 4 du. And that gives us, let's open this, u squared minus 2u to the power of 4 plus u to the power of 6 du, right? And this is a polynomial with powers. Integration will be u cube one third minus two over five u to the power of five plus one over seven u to the power of seven plus c. Right now, replace u with sine, so we get one third of sine cube x minus two fifth of sine to the power of five x plus 1 7 sine to the power of 7x plus c right so that is how you are going to solve such a question here is a practice question for you as we have been doing for some of our videos so we'll now change this question a bit write it as a sine with odd power and cosine with even power right dx so i like you to find the integral for this function. Now here, since we have odd power of sine, we'll keep sine aside. So that means the substitution should be u equals to cos x, correct? That's the even power. So du will be equals to minus sine x dx. And if you keep one sine aside, you can easily do it. So you get sine to the power of 6x cos to the power of 4x times sine x dx. So that should help you to solve it further and find the solution. I am Anil Kumar and I hope these simple techniques help you to efficiently solve integrals as we are discussing. I am Anil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos and don't forget to put a like on it. Thank you and all the best.